Abdul Mahathir um, recently seems to have gained this new status as like this idol for a lot of people on social media. Um, and a lot of them are concerned about his health and asking him to take a rest because, you know, he's been doing so much in these few weeks. So um, how do you uh, feel about this? Well, I concur with all the people's uh, concern about his health. And especially for me, who is very close to him, staying in the house, the same house, I do worry about his health. Not that there is an, uh, anything um, uh, severe or major, but uh, to please remember that he has had two bypasses. Yes, yeah, and uh, the, the most serious one was the last one, 2007. And what is worrying now is about uh, his lungs. If he has any allergy or any infection of his, his throat, then it will start uh, a series of uh, irritation, sore throat, and then goes the the infection goes down to the lungs. And once it gets to the lungs, it will take a lot of time, um, sometimes uh, weeks before he can recover from it. Ever since. Uh, Tun became Prime Minister again. Have you tried to convince him to take more, a bit more rest? Of course I have. <laughs> Has he I rest. And he says, I'm fine, I'm fine, <laughs> gung-ho. That's why I have to gung-ho with him also. Because I follow him wherever he goes. Mm -hmm. So do you think he's very stubborn also? Definitely. <laughs> mm. Aren't husbands stubborn? <laughs> mm. What were some of the ways that you manage, you manage yeah. to tell Tun that, okay, now you have to listen to me. You have to take your rest. Sometimes now. I do that, you know. Mm -hmm. I, I really insist. Sometimes I don't care. I say, I'm looking after you. And then I have I, my role to play. This is my duty now. You have a duty to the people, I have a duty to you. The people ask me to take care of you. So now I'm, I'm just playing the role. So how, how are you managing, uh, you know, Tun's routine, you know, to ensure that he doesn't, like such as his diet or his... Uh... Uh, the diet, uh, I don't worry so much because he disciplines himself in whatever he, he takes. He doesn't take much. But whatever food he loves to eat, he carries on. And, uh, but uh, I'm more concerned about his schedule, that he has ample time to rest. And he must rest after, formally before Ramadan, after lunch. And even even now, if there's a lot of appointments until 12 o'clock or 1 o'clock, I sh insist that he rest away from people at least one hour or one and a half hours. So he just rests, close his eyes, 40 wings. So you make, sh so you make sure even now he has yes. breaks in between? Yes, and I know he wants it. Here, wherever he wherever he goes uh, to uh, work, there will be a private room for him to do that. 